Look at this. It says in a class there are 15 students in a group. If three more students are taken into consideration, then the average of the uh, group, average of the age of group increases by one. If six more students are taken into consideration, then the average of the age of group decreases by one. If there is a difference of six years in the total ages of students added both time, find the average of first 15 students in the group. So and I think an interesting one on average, there are three different cases here, right? There are 15 students in a group. Let's assume their average is A, right? Initial average is A, original average is A, right? So the original average is equal to A. So can I say the sum of the ages of these 15 students, sum of the ages of these 15 students is equal to 15 times A? Yes or no? You know that sum is equal to average into the number of students. So sum of the ages of students is 15 times A. Now, if three more students are considered into this group, then the average increases by one. So we are taking three more students, right? The new sum, sum of 15 plus 3, 18 students. If three more students are considered, then the average increases by one. So what will be the sum in that case? See, sum again is number of students into the average. Number of students this time is 15 plus 3, 18. Average increases by one, it says. Average increases by one. So the new average will be A plus one, right? So this is A plus one, A plus one. If six more students are taken into consideration, then the average decreases by one. So when you take three more students, average increases by one. But if you take six more students into consideration, right? If six more students are added into the group, then the average decreases by one. So the sum of these, this group, 15 students plus six, will be how much? See, total number of students are 21. Average decreases by one, A minus one. You're getting it. I'm assuming original average is A. Based on that, the original sum of 15 students, sum of the ages of 15 students should be 15A. Number of students into the average. When three more students are added, average increases by one. So total 18 students, average is A plus one. If six more students are added, the sum of their ages will be, see 15 plus six, 21 students, average is A minus one. So 21 into A minus one will give us a sum. Now look at the next point. It says the difference is six years. The difference is six years in the total ages of students added both time. Meaning the difference of 21 students and, the dif and 18 students. Sum of the ages of 21 students and sum of the ages of 18, stu uh, 18 students. Their difference is six years. Find the average of first 15 students. So basically what the uh, you know statement tells us here is that 15, uh, you know, S of sum of sum of 15 plus 6 minus the sum of 15 plus 3. See, these are the two new groups, right? Total age of the students added both the time. Sum of the ages of 15 plus 6 minus sum of the ages of 15 plus 3 is equal to 6 years. 6 years is the difference. In the total ages of students added both time. Actually, we have to take the ages of those 6 students minus the ages of 3 students. I am taking the 15 students on both the sides. It doesn't matter because it gets cancelled anyway, right? Sum of the ages of 15 students and sum of the ages of 15 students will get cancelled on these two sides. So, what we eventually get is the sum of the ages of six students which are added here and sum of the ages of three students that were added here and their difference is equal to six years now put what we have already got here sum of the ages of 15 plus 6 is 21 times of a minus 1 minus of 18 times of a plus 1 is equal to 6 now simplify this 21 a minus 18 a 3 a minus 21 minus 18 is equal to 6 which implies 3 a equals to how much is this? Uh, 39. 39 goes other side. It becomes plus 39. 39 plus 6 is 45. So 3a is 45 implies a will be 15. And that's what is required, right? Find the average of first 15 students in the group. First 15 students average was taken as a, which came out to be 15. So option 4 will be the answer. Please do not go by the length of the explanation and the number of steps here. You can, you can cut down a lot of these steps, right? So answer will be 15 years, option 4.